What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Baby Curious Ways, and I'm back with another video. Ooh. Today, I'm going to be doing a updated get to know me. So make sure you like, come subscribe, and let's get to this video. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Get to know me. Okay, so first of all, my full my name, my full name is Akiria Jakaya Edwards. Um, where did I get the name Baby Kira from? I got the name Baby Kira from. Okay, so when I was in like sixth grade, that's when I first got social media, and everything was cute, smart, pretty, or pretty smart, cute. I don't know why I liked it that I just wanted to be different. I wanted my name to be different. And then that's why my Snapchat name cues my pretty. Cause it go way, way back, way back. It's this great back. But anyways, um eventually I didn't I just started to dislike the name. But I wanted to find a name that I didn't think many people had. I didn't really know people had that had baby in front of their name since like till like seventh grade. But um what was I saying? I didn't really know till like seventh grade that they had that other people had baby in the beginning of their name. But I wasn't finna give it up. Where did I get the idea of baby from? I had the word baby from because sixth grade everybody told me I had a baby face. And I knew it was somebody with the name baby face. In the beginning of their name, so I just put baby. Then I got did baby dot cura underscore, cause everybody had an underscore and a dot in their name, but I wanted to help dot cura underscore to not give baby and cura their little space. So that's really where I got baby cura from, and then yeah, I've had the same name since um sixth grade and i have considered changing it but no i can't do it mm -mm, mm -mm. okay so my birthday is on january 9th i was born in 2007 i'm 15 years old i just turned 15 um my zodiac sign and my capricorn got on the necklace capricorn and yeah, I am in ninth grade. I am a freshman at high school. Today, my first, my high school. <laughs> okay, so my high school lately has been a roller coaster. Like I've had my good moments, my horrible, when I just wanted to sit in bed all day. But you know, I I'm a G. I'm pushing P. I can handle it. I'm a, I can handle it. But sometimes it just be too much for me to handle and I just be needing a break. I just be needing that time off. Cause girl, if we didn't have the weekends, I don't know what how I would survive that school. Yeah. But lately it's been okay. It's it hasn't really been horrible, but it's it's like it's been a real eye opener. So, do I need to lift up? I think this needs to come up. Can I do it like this? Yeah. I like it better like this. But, yeah. Let me brighten this up. Okay. But, yeah. It's been a real eye-opener. And some stuff is really like, it is what it is. But... I just need to learn to stop stressing over it because it's out of my hands. So, yeah. From where I'm from and where I live now, I am from Greenwood, Mississippi. If you all know where Greenwood, Mississippi is, that is in Mississippi Delta. You know, I was really raised around Elvina. And Elvina is like the countryside. Like the deep Delta countryside. In LaFleur County. So, yeah. But I moved to Memphis in <clears throat> fifth grade. 
right so i've been staying in memphis for like four or five years and i like it up here i like it a lot you know have friends you know memphis look get up i know y'all know about memphis so i'm not gonna talk about it i'm not gonna talk about it but yeah it's been real good i yeah i've gotten used to it when i started youtube i started youtube up in sixth grade now you you're not gonna see none of my sixth grade videos but i got like my first 30 followers up in sixth grade and sixth grade i loved it i don't really know why i stopped but i loved it was my heart and passion youtube was my heart and passion <laughs> You couldn't tell me nothing. I love YouTube. And I used to make little videos on a computer. And, you know, I used to do pranks. I used to make my thumbnails. I used to make videos with my little brother. I used to force him to be in my videos. You know, I was having a ball of my life. I deleted all of them videos. Y'all was not going to catch me sleeping like that. Mm -mm. I had, like... I think like 12 videos yeah I made 12 videos oh yeah I had stopped because the computer that I had broken and the the gmail the gmail that I had connected to my youtube I didn't know the password and I tried to get it back and but I didn't feel like waiting no two to three business days but <clears throat> I think the day, like the week that I made my first video, let me see. Yeah, it was like last year. So last year when I made my get, no, my introduction video that week, I had finally had actually did it. I waited my two to be two to three business days, and then I started back doing YouTube on this phone. But. <clears throat> Yeah, I started back doing YouTube on this phone. And then I stopped because the phone wasn't having enough storage. And then, like, I started back doing YouTube, like, four months later on my mama phone. So, yeah. And now, I'm doing it consistently because, you know, I have a new phone. I have an SR now, and it has a lot of storage. So, I've been doing videos like every four days so yeah i'm having the best time of my life i love doing videos it really just brings me back that happiness from when i was in sixth grade because youtube just gave me my sparkle it gave me my shine but um yeah the next question is why i started youtube i think that it can obvious well let me not okay so i started youtube after I hit 1K on Instagram. Yeah, I started YouTube when I hit 1K on Instagram. And then... No, not 1K. I started doing YouTube when I had 800 followers on Instagram. And then... What happened? What happened? What happened? I had 1K on Instagram. I mean, not 1K. 800 on Instagram. And then I seen, I seen this, this one video of this girl. Her name is Melena, Life of Lena. I call her Melena, but her name is Life of Lena. And she just, she just looked me so happy. And I was like, I want to make videos like her. So I didn't, I didn't have a phone at the time. I had a tablet and a computer. So I started using, I had started using, um, I started using the computer to record my videos and I used to edit them. I used to have my best for editing on videos. I used to stay up to like two o'clock in the morning, just editing and editing. And then I, for, I uploaded my first YouTube video and it got like 20 views and I was so so happy like my heart was jumping down my soul happy and no it wasn't 20 i got like 
10. I just know I had a very low amount of views and I was just so happy. My heart was fulfilled. I only had two subscribers and 10 views and I was still jumping. Still jumping. I was just so happy and grateful for every last one of them. I still am. But yeah, that's the main reason why I started YouTube. It was just always been so fun for me. It's just been so, 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 um refreshing it's been my way to breathe basically what i do for fun for fun oh yeah i've gotten to basketball i've always liked the basketball but i was not like i like when i was a cheerleader i used to see my best friend who was playing basketball get beat up on court like one girl pulled her hair and some more stuff and I was like, oh, I, can't do it. I can't do it. But this year, I tried out for both basketball and cheerleading. And I didn't make the cheerleading. So I stuck to basketball and I made the basketball team. And, you know, I'm still learning some stuff. Like, I'm starting to watch games and stuff. Like, I'm really, like, getting into it. Like, it's been really interesting to me. I don't know why, but it has. You know, every time I make my little shy, I, I get happy. My heart feels. So, yeah. I've been doing a lot of stuff lately that has ba been making me just so happy. And I still don't understand why I be sad sometimes. I don't know. We'll figure it out later. That's a, that's a, that's a conversation for later. Have I achieved any of my goals yet? Um, One of my... I have a list of goals in my notes and I call it um my goals what is the list let me find it <clears throat> okay so I have a list of goals and one of my main goals was to hit 100 subscribers I did that um get a camera I'm working on it um and get 4k watch views and in order for me to get more watch views I have to make more videos so I've been trying to get that I'm on my way I'm on my way I should have set the the score a little bit lower lower because I shouldn't have expected to hit 4k watch views in like five months but you know I was in my moment and I believe I believed in myself no, I'm going to say I believe in myself. I believe in myself. I believe I can make that. You know, we're going to speak into existence. I'm going to hit 4K views one day, one day, during that this year, this timeline. And, yeah, my last video, I think, <laughs> I was a little heavy. Not my last video, but, like, a video I did, like, last year, my Olivia Rodrigo, um, video it's a i think is it that 800 or 900 views yeah i have 800 views on that video and my night routine video is at 200 i've been talking for so long and my bullet point my bullet points have been that ain't even been that much this all I had. I've just been kept talking and talking. Like, I know you might not like to hear me talk, but I talk a lot. But that was the last um bullet point. So, <sighs> make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I need to come up with a, like, a end piece of my video because... All I got is, if you can't follow me on Instagram, follow me on this, follow me on that. But, you know, I don't know. I'll figure it out. But, I love y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. If you can't subscribe, add me on Instagram, at baby.like If you can't, add me on Instagram, add me on Snapchat, cute, smart, pretty. If you can't, add me on Snapchat, add me on TikTok. At baby dot Kira. If you can't add me on TikTok, add me on Twitter, baby Kira. Um, I love y'all.
and I'll see y'all in my next